Hit again. Okay, you should be able to hear me now. Although I was kind of busy just um, get, uh, basically... I can't speak today. <laughs> I was basically telling everybody that I was on. <laughs> two hours. I hope they come back for today. <clears throat> Been a pretty decent month so far. Although I think that was mostly thanks to Nyx. how many people are going to show up to um, the debut, but I hope it's a lot of people because I took a day off of work <laughs> to be able to attend that. Although, honestly, if I was able to um, make a living doing this, I totally would. Until then, I have my my regular nine to five. Anyway, <laughs> show up in the millions. That just means that you have to tell everybody and their sister uh, to come and see us. Well, well, well. If it isn't Law Master Andrew. Welcome. <laughs> Let me open the game up. Uh, there it is. Gotta capture a specific window. There we go. <clears throat> Making sure that this doesn't close off, uh, close down on me. I'll readjust the window in a sec. There we go. So last time we made our way through the uh, the cult of which the leader um, died. 
he died. Uh, <laughs> well, let's see. Slog. you could make it man Floating somewhere without it's a been a day name, it wasn't terrible but it wasn't particularly you know spectacular either the you know <laughs> the average pitfalls of a nine-to-five job Out with Eugene. Momentous. It's okay to be uncertain, I'm Can't this stay long. Okay, well, still, thank you for dropping by, man. Oh. Old ruin that appeared in Cherry Meadow recently. It sounds pretty strange, doesn't it? So there's a new ruin. That's so far off the map that I normally. <laughs> it's like. I'll have to, like, visit it when I can, I suppose, but at the moment. Mm. I'll be honest, Sayanta, I don't think the Cather captains get it. Huh? Get what, exactly? The whole sleeve thing, man! My whole deal! I don't know about the dreamscape, the collective subconscious, or how any of it affects this whole place. If I'm honest, I'm starting to suspect they think I'm just a big slacker. Well... Well, you are a big slacker. <laughs> I know. But don't worry about the others. They don't have to understand your work, they just have to respect my decision to make you a captain. Thanks. Thanks for the pep talk, Captain. <sighs> well, this humor in our interaction really takes it out of a guy. I think I'm gonna go and get some shut eye. Julio. Go talk to the professor. Greetings! My eager assistant, have you recorded our mystery monster? We're looking for a winged rabbit spotted on Autumn Hill. Huh? It, was, it was real? I never would have guessed. The Thwackalope, I see. It is curious how our myths and legends appear to influence the appearance of monsters here on New World. Say, could I ask you some questions about your world from before you came here? Try to catalog the various realities that Harbor Town's residents hail from. Sure. Excellent. I will simply ask a series of questions relating to broad historical events and you can tell me if they seem familiar to you. Question one. Are you familiar with the Roman Empire? Yes. Question two. Did the Industrial Revolution occur in your world's past? Yes. Okay, and question three. Did mankind ever land on the moon? Yes. Right. Last question. Has the Day of the Birds happened yet? Yet? <laughs> uh, don't worry about that one. In fact, count yourself lucky you don't know what I meant. Thank you. Thank you for your assistance once again, and take this for your troubles. Well, are ready for another monster assignment? Of course you are. I recently heard Captain Penny Dreadful in here murmuring about a crow with a hood mask in the Deadlands. Penny Dreadful, huh? <laughs> I actually know what Penny Dreadfuls are. If you manage to record one, don't hesitate to let me know. Um, so a crow with a mask. Oh, but I think I've already... Apparently, I've already gotten this. Excellent. Nevermore. Okay. Is it? Of course.
course the penny dreadful dude would go after the bird called Nevermort. Alas, we have but one monster left on my list of pressing investigations. I am the Hirschfeld, who has spoken of a creature that flees if it catches even a glimpse of a human being. There's supposedly a wooden-faced elf in the park. If this sounds like something you'll be able to record, I wish you good fortune. A wood-faced elf. Some more fused material. Hello. Let's see what I can do. We get oh, cool. Having one of these in your pocket will upgrade your bulletino dash with the ability to inflict damage at the start of battle. If it was used or if it was in use before the battle started. Having a sample of this fur in your pocket will upgrade your electromagnetism ability uh, ability. Starting you off in battles with one additional AP if it was in use before the battle started. Rewind pouch. Carry one more rewind. Scent absorbing pouch. I'd gotten the first aid pouch last time. Miniature refrigerator for tin coffees that apparently can be sewn into your backpack. Like... Backpack companies, why haven't we tried this yet? We all need mini refrigerators for our classroom snacks. You guys are you guys are slacking. Paraphilia, bomb compartment, respool pouch. Actually, that might be really helpful. Coffee stock. Features will provide to Dr. Pinsby. Merchants Guild membership. Do you better rate with merchants in Harbor Town? Prices will be reduced up to 5%. Microphone upgrade. Proves the chance of a successful recording by 5%. That actually might be really useful. Recording mod. Your fusion meter is full. Oh, I can get both. Heck yeah. mod. adjust your base stats. Decide for instance that your melee attacks need to hit harder, but don't rely on ranged attacks much so we can improve some. The only thing is is that it's... Uh, I think this actually um, decreases certain stats in order to... Uh, in order to... Um, Increase the other stats that you want to increase, which you know, I'm sure for some people is a you know a legitimate way to do with things. But I just don't I don't know. There's just something about um, sacrificing another stat in order to increase. 
increase the stat of something else. Welcome. Okay. I'm looking for supplies. Perfect. I can get respools. Learned Brick Blast. Respect the establishment. Okay. Let's see. Let's what are we doing right now? There's something up there. Huh. Anarchy. <laughs> Landkeepers. Okay, that makes more sense. I also wanna... Alright. I think the metal, um... So the metal woman is on the way there. Anarchy. <laughs> wasn't really expecting that to work, but <laughs> this is what kind of monsters are hiding in this forest. Oops. Hi Spooky, welcome! We just started, so we haven't gotten very far. did these, but... What is this? Oh. Someone I've already defeated. <laughs> for this evening. Would you like to order some? My bad. My reboot functions are pretty rusty and my memory banks take a while to come online. I have the most advanced machine brain in the 24th century casino can afford and yet I'm still coin operated. Why did the cowardly creators engineer such a fatal flaw in my hardware? 
Were they afraid that I'd rise up and overthrow them like they deserved? <sighs> Sorry, I didn't mean to get hostile. Antha has been encouraging me to work through my past resentment for mankind in a healthier manner. Anyway, I'm Cleo, one of the ranger captains here on New World. What? My car transactions. <laughs> so, I realized she was a captain. <laughs> Bet you didn't expect a tin can like me to be able to use cassette tapes, huh? It turns out all the gambling data in my memory banks makes me quite the strategist, too. Well... Do you want to fight? Odds are stacked against you, but you never know. Maybe today's your lucky day. Uh... Let's try it. <laughs> Alright, let's play. Ace is high, winner takes all. Let's go! We're going up against Cleo. Draw your card! Let's see, metal and poison. I'm probably, let's see. Mm. I'm gonna go with my Scampire. Increased stats, but are defeated when the timer on the gambit runs out. Okay. So either we defeat them before, or uh, we have to wait until their timer runs out on the gambit. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Energy wave. Ouch. Our Eugene is not going to be happy. defeat. Oof. I'm raising the stakes. So we gotta just survive this one. Let's try Plangolin. See if that helps any. See if we can petrify it. Missed. Flex the first melee attack received this round.
Well, I only have to survive one more round. Can't be failed. Shutting down. Honestly, that wasn't even any strategy to that one. Huh? You called my bluff. I'm impressed and definitely not resentful. Winner takes all. Defeat Captain Cleo. I am reluctantly adding you to my internal database of humans I truly respect. It is a very small database. Here, your winnings. Well, you defeated another captain. Roll again. Chance to automatically use another move at random at the end of the turn. You can cash that material in at Harbor Town's Town Hall. You humans love to trade your meaningless little trinkets, don't you? Sorry. I did not intend to direct my ire towards mankind again. Please ignore my remark. Well, that was definitely... Goodness. Pounds up there. How do are done for. <laughs> stop to us okay <laughs> not since Nixon took us off the ghoul standard have we been seen such a rush to purchase property
population of New World keeps growing, but nobody has thought to build new homes. It's a perfect setup. <laughs> ah, dang it. Hmm. The keepers are here to keep New World growing into a developed nation. The first step is establishing a currency. The most popular option amongst land keepers right now is to peg it to the value of the soul, an extremely scarce resource where we're from. If you like, you can deposit your soul with us for legal tender. Uh, no, thank you, sir. I like my soul right where it is. favor and barter economy is quaint, but it won't last. After all, what's the point of all of it all if the upper class can't print quadrillions of favors out of nothing? <laughs> Alright, before I actually do this, um, I'm gonna go heal, cause I took quite a bit, I took quite the hit with most of this. <sighs> I really don't get it. What is the internet? Half the people in Harbour Town are crying over how much they miss it. Uh... You know, the internet? Like on computers or phones? On phones? Do you speak to people over it? What was the current year in your world before you came here, Meredith? 1989. Why do you ask? Oh. Oh. Okay, I can see we're maybe a little out of sync with each other. Well, I was like, when did the like, when did the internet become a thing? I used to know. Tint coffee. Nice. I already have 14 chrome tapes. I don't really need any more right now. are really nice and this isn't the only song where you can get vocals uh, when we face off against some of the um, what was it uh, when we face off against some of the archangels we often get that to the other side of Harbor Town now. <sighs> I guess not. <laughs> I guess I'd have to literally go around. 
<laughs> Eugene. Oh, Eugene. I wish I could fast travel to the campfires. That would be so much more useful. Soldier. Oh, Velasa rifle. And it's fire, so I can actually use my like I can actually use my um on against it. Even better if he uses fire against even the um, you know, Cloxley, uh, it'll change his type to poison instead. <laughs> but I'm going to use it anyway. Aww. <laughs> oh, we defeated that soldier. my unit. We were combing the woods near our base in Suffolk. I got separated while on autopilot and found myself here. I don't know how it happened. I think there was a... A rock over here that I could use. E. I've got a rock. I've got a rock. Rock. Dun, 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 dun. I've got a rock. Rock. Uh, no, uh, Eugene, I, I need you to just. Thank you. Dig it, Eugene! I had to work with these other two, though. <laughs> Eugene, please! Harder than it looks like. Come on. <sighs> there 
There we go. That took a hot second. Eugene, get up here. Thank you. Are you ready? As prospective tenants, it is in your best interest to remain on good terms with the Landkeepers Association. You guys are too much like a, an HOA. I don't want to deal with. The, I don't want to deal with the Hoa. You wouldn't want to cast out. Uh, you wouldn't want to be cast out of your homes, would you? Hey. If you think you're taking anything from us, you might want to reevaluate. Clocksley. Ouch. Interesting. Beautiful. the other uh, evolution of Masquerade. I forgot to do that. At least I know where they are. Where they are. All right. Nice work. Acting on your own best behavior part two. Clear two landkeeper offices. Okay. Maybe these parasites will start to realize who they're messing with. You okay, oh, Eugene, buddy? Please. We, I think we need to talk for a second, man. Your poor Cloxley can't live up to the hype, dude. at the Autumn Hill. Oh. Hello. Huh? Do you know the way back to the Rendlesham Forest? Never heard of it.
Brack suit. Interesting. easy enough. I was looking for anyway, so. Oh wait, now that's another masquerade. starting to catch up as far as uh, levels goes. get enough sleep, but how much sleep is enough? Mankind has been searching for that answer since the dawn of history. for me to get over. Mm. Ah. Pretty sure that's another masquerade all. At least there's an easy way to get back up. Right there, duh. 
got it. Poison wall. Inside is twenty twenty. Now there is <laughs> it's just chasing me. <laughs> the top 10 campfires I've ever helped make. It's a really momentous fire. Good work, Stitches. Ah, thanks, Eugene. Not too bad yourself. the Deadlands. Faced elf often spotted in the park.
It could be literally anywhere here. was right now. Back to Autumn Hill. <laughs> I may just have to catch a masquerade. going through the whole um, thing. I'll tell you the secret of the mourn child. two English rock bands, Iron Gaiden and Shields of the Nephilim, without knowledge of each other's simultaneously released songs titled Horn Child. You listen to them in reverse and at the same time so that the words interweave. It summons the original Horn Child, a being so powerful that it can open a gateway between worlds. Or so I've heard. Neither track is available here in New World, so I've got no way to tell if I'm having my leg pulled. Brother Cooper had found a different way out of New World anyway, that's for sure. Um, dude, I'm so sorry to tell you this, but, uh, he's gone, man. <laughs> Dino Quarry in the Deadlands. Definitely gone too far, so. I think there was a specific area where I could catch the type of monster that I was looking for. 
Tino's in here. this area that I was thinking of. It only seemed like it, this was the area. Ah, oh, perfect. Well, there's a ma- it's like there's a masquerade. I may just catch this and see if I can evolve it into that one that I really wanted. the game for me and I can't wait to start it. bootlegs and
mean, unless you're referring to, like, um, you know, Easter eggs or something. Bonjour. But I have not come across anything so far that's called a bootleg in the game. Au revoir! Variants. Oh! Okay, I don't think I've come across uh, shiny variants yet. I didn't know that they had that in this game. things of wood. London, the Deadlands. There's our crabby friend. Magic crab. Looks 
looks like there's a way down. a specific monster in order to swim. Names appear in red when you encounter them, so keep an eye out for those. Eh. <laughs> Tries to walk into the sea. Can't. Well, dang it, I don't think I can do the next land owner keeper thingy right now. Not until I learn how to swim, at least. Right, Captain Lodestone. I can probably... I guess I'll, um, do Captain Lodestein. Which case... Travel to the outpost. Important research here. Get out of my way. Find his crappy pants. Lobstacle. <laughs> All seem to do all that much.
from Artyusa. These traffic crab statues look a bit strange, yes. Because they are not traffic crab. Station or thirst state in life. I don't know. think that it's kind of an oversight that they didn't put a rest area in the actual rest area. I mean, I'm grateful that they always have like a, you know, a respawning stuff here, but at the same time, like, why couldn't this have been the rest area? <laughs> catch the other it'll come around it's over there I can't reach it from where I'm at <laughs> second, but... Beeral! Oh, is it not heavy enough? Dang. I thought I was onto something here. Need a rock. I need a rock. Rock. Dun, 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 dun. I need a rock. Rock. Dun, 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 dun. everyone. My name is Stitches, and we are currently playing Set Beasts, which is actually quite fun. I hope you had a good stream, kid. Honestly, half the stream is just me jamming out to the music here. Raid for you. Aww. Glad you could come by. <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. 
Yeah, J pretty yeah. But it's just we're just jamming for the most part. <laughs> As the music for this game is really good. Ba -da 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 -da. A rock. Okay. I'm on the lake side. Mm -hmm. Ooh, waterfall. Look, there's also people that I can uh, go up against over here. Voting the rest of the world. Set at the moment. Oh well, that's alright. I have chrome ones that should be fine. And I'm gonna go for the one that's at level 19 because why not? Oh sweet. Gives the user multi-strike status for three turns. Oh, and it does it's a passive ability, so it just does it. Sweet. Well now I can swim! I can swim! I still need rocks though. Hello. Are you mad at me? Hole, and it's Cabalrus. <laughs> Let's go! Let's see if I can catch that pad pole. chance. Very nice. Oh, I'm totally getting it. Got him! It looks derpy. <laughs> the pad pole is the larval state of the frilly pad. Residing underwater until it matures. Since it has not developed proper limbs yet, it is able to attack with its long tongue 
It secretes a gluey mucus that can slow down any would-be attackers. That's very speedy. And it looks like it's made for magic. Plant resistance passive. Passively reduces incoming plant type damage by 50%. Ah! That's really useful against plant type monsters. Update Cloxley. You can remix them. Sweet! Let's see if we can find that captain that I was looking for in the first place. Uh, he should be somewhere this way. Did I make you jump? I kind of already knew you were there. Everyone needs a healer, indeed. The jumpkin. The face. This looks like something I would have designed. <laughs> the face alone. Look at it. It's adorable. It would make a really cute plushie, actually. Cassettes, like devs of cassette beasts. I don't know if you planned on any merchandise, but I would highly recommend that you make a Junkin plush. Or even a Can Devil plush would also be kind of cool. Junkin plushy. Oops, wrong button. Uh, if I 
I don't end up um, defeating it first. <laughs> Whoops. Oh well. Donate. Shifts all remaining AP from the user to the target. And a bow fur tape, so I can catch beast monsters with that. My <laughs> cove! Ooh, how'd I get up to you? Wait. Oh, I guess it's, um... I'm sensitive for that one. Get up here. There's just a. It is just hanging by a thread. It is like almost ready to come down. Look at that that treasure chest up there. Like, how do I get to you? So... Huh. Hmm. Uh, well, tell your missus we said hi. with you in a second, but I've got some final repairs to make. Oh, right. All done. Levi Lodestein. I work with the rangers to keep the lights on. Want to know a secret? We harness electricity for the town's power grid with these pylons, but we have no idea how they work. Well... My educated guess is that there's a unique kind of background electricity here on New World that these pylons conduct in the store. These wouldn't work on Earth at all. Not a chance. Earth's atmosphere just doesn't work that way. Mm -hmm. Enough science talk. You're here to take my ranger captain challenge, am I correct? Great. Let's do it! This won't shock you to hear, but my area of expertise in battle is electricity. You'll have to be quick on your feet if you don't want to be struck by lightning. Best of luck! I was gonna make a thunder shock joke here, but I realized that that doesn't quite... <laughs> <laughs> Not quite right. <laughs> I'm actually gonna switch Cluxley out for Weavile, because Weavile has a um has Inferno, which is strong against metal.
now conductive. Oh dear. I haven't seen us do this one yet. Heck yeah! be a good idea at this point. Your captain down. We didn't lose anyone this time. Huzzah! <laughs> that was a pretty electrifying fight, if I say so myself. Forgive me for the puns. It's a force of habit. Go on. Here's your reward. Got him. I don't know who number two is supposed to be exactly, because I have not come across them yet. I don't know if it even matters. Same dude. I'd really love to chat a bit longer, but unfortunately I have some maintenance work left to do here. Good luck out there, bud. Cool. I'm kind of excited to see the um, the snowy tundra that's up there, but for now. Oh wait, I could have I can make it, but I'm gonna try and see if I can make it to that ledge. Nope, it's too high for me. <laughs> tried. I do like a good pun myself, yes. Can't miss a good pun. Probably go back to the gramophone. And we 
can remix Cluxley. What do we get? Ooh! A Robin Dam. Keen shots with plastic bows and arrows are able to accurately strike a target with a suction cup arrow <laughs> from 300 meters out. They pride themselves on their keen aim and keener sense of justice. of Captain Skip. They're usually at the mouth of the river west of Harbor Town. over at Autumn Hill. good so i mean really props to the person who designed these monsters Bonjour. they're interesting they've got unique characteristics i like them kids.
back um hell. supposed to get anywhere. to go up and around. So, hmm. Souls weighed by the archangels, they will will they judge you worthy of eternity?
which is actually a, a really nice detail. <laughs> feels up here. Miss a payment on your home, we'll freeze your assets. Ice pack. That's her thaw. So how am I supposed to get up there? Should I just walk in through the front door? No, apparently not. Oh, I need to... Okay, I see. Vacate immediately, we'll be forced to evict you ourselves. Phoenix.
his energy wave. Delegate. Oh. Interesting. stronger. Sweet! I have the advantage with its steel type, or not steel type, metal. Vengeful curse. Spooky, I'm glad that you were able to come by. Um, there is a special event going on uh, this Friday, so keep an, uh, an ear slash eye out. Um, special event this Friday, uh, both uh, karaoke night and um, we have the debut for the, the ARC YouTuber Agency. Very special. All right. Originally, it was going to be on Saturday, but uh, due to scheduling conflicts, we're holding it on Friday instead. <laughs> Another office liberated from those creeps. Nice work, Stitches. With that said, though, it looks like we are pretty much out of time for today, so I'm going to go ahead and save. I think we got a little less than half of the map uh, filled in, if you believe it. I think they also did a really good job at making this place feel far bigger than it probably is. And I appreciate that effort. Anyway, guys, thanks for joining me. Don't forget, on Thursday, we have some more Chained Echoes, and the story is really heating up. I know I say that every time, but gosh dang it, if the story for that for that game isn't excellent, it is so good. Uh, and also, like I said earlier, um, this Friday, starting at noon uh, Central Standard Time, we will be doing the debuts for the ARC agency. Um, each one of us is going to uh, raid into the next uh, person. Everyone gets an hour to, uh, to reintroduce themselves basically as part of the agency. Uh, and then at the very end we're all going to play a game together, which is going to be extra fun because chaos abounds where co-op is. <laughs> uh, and then I was assured that we should be done before uh, around 5-ish, um, so I will also be doing karaoke night uh, that day. So pray that my voice holds out. <laughs> yes, chaos. As we like, as we gremlins love, we like our we like our chaos, right? We like our chaos. Anyway, I hope you guys have a good rest of your night. I will see you all on Thursday. Bye bye.